Okay, ladies and gents, here we are back again on Dark Souls 2, continuing my run with Ninja Penguins, and we are here inside a Drang Link Castle about to take on the Watcher and Defender. As I go ahead and set this fight up, it's going to be a four on two situation here as we go in and take on the Watcher and Defender. Alright, me and Ninja Penguins are now set. Our two NPC help are set. We got Vengarl and Benhart with us. Start this fight off, go ahead and buff our weapons, and we go ahead and hop right in. Okay, here they come, the Watcher and Defender. Alright, one of the keys of these, this fight here is, first off, you want to get them separated. And sometimes it's kind of hard to do, but this time we don't do too bad. We get them separated, and after you get them separated, you want to work both their health at the same time. You want to keep their both their health bars moving down at the same time. Because if you don't, come the end of this fight, when you're down to one of them, and one of them is sitting there down, the other guy will run up and revive that other uh, guy that went down. And it could be a very bad situation. Especially if you lost people during the fight, and he brings somebody back, then it's going to be curtains for you. And we don't want that. But so far we're doing good. Keeping both their health bars moving in the downward direction. It's all good for us. Haven't lost any NPCs. There the uh, defender go ahead and buffs his weapon. So we're going to go ahead and finish wearing him out. And right there defender is done. Then we go ahead and start working on the watcher. And there goes the watcher buffing his weapon. But we, we're not having that trash. I go ahead and rebuff my weapon. Go ahead and run back in there. Put the finishing touches on the watcher before he goes and brings the defender back up. Hey, and there you go. Me and Ninja Penguins knocking out the watcher and defender here in Drangling Castle. Hey, ladies and gents, thanks again for watching.